Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if you're coming across an issue on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer that reads that there is an error saving your wireless profile. So if you're coming across this message that says Windows has encountered an error saving the wireless profile, specific error, the system cannot find the file specified. This should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match, or come back with command prompt, right-click on it, and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And then into this elevator command line window, type in ipconfig, followed by a space, forward slash flush DNS, Flush DNS should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard. Should come back a Windows IP configuration. Successfully flushed the DNS resolver cache. Now you want to type in NETSH space Winsock, W I N S O C K, space reset. Once again, exactly how you see it on my screen. And hit enter. Should come back with successfully reset the Winsock catalog. You must restart the computer in order to complete the reset. At this point, go ahead and close out of here. And then hopefully at this point, the issue should have been resolved. If you're still having a problem, we can try to reset our network settings back to default. Please keep in mind with the step we're about to show here, if you reset your network settings and you're using Wi-Fi, you will need to enter those credentials back in or to get back on the internet once you restart your computer. So make sure you have those credentials nearby before you proceed with the next step. And that would entail opening up the search menu. And you want to type in network reset. Best match, should come back with network reset. Go ahead and open that up. Now, this will remove and then reinstall all of your network adapters and set other networking components back to their original settings. You might need to reinstall other networking software afterwards, such as VPN client software or virtual switches. Your PC will be restarted. Go ahead and select reset now. It's going to ask, are you sure you want to reset your network settings? Select yes. And then at this point, you will be signed out of your computer if you don't manually restart your device, which I would encourage you to do so at this time. So let's go ahead and restart our computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully this point or issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.